previously on Sailing Aquarius. In Barcelona, my mom joined us and we took off this time from Palma, Mallorca towards Gibraltar. So what did we break? We left Mallorca and sailed to Gibraltar for three and a half days. When we reached Gibraltar, it was pitch dark, plus 25-30 knots of winds and gusts. So we were very happy when Marina let us dock overnight next to the fuel dock. Technically, we are still in Spain, as it's cheaper and easier without check-ins and walking distance from Gibraltar. Next morning, we redocked Aquarius in a slip and we had to fix some damage done on the passage. So, we had a problem again with our main and uh, it looks like I'm gonna have to go up and change a few things on the, um, the main traveler connection to the uh, main sheet. And just for you guys, it's always good to have some Dyneema line like this on board your boat as spares so you can fix things. So just put that on the list of stuff to have. The first thing we're gonna have to do is loosen the sheet on the main because it's gotta come all the way out. Not a very nice day here in Gibraltar. So you can see how we rigged this thing so that it didn't move around during the rest of the passage. And you can see we broke our line connecting these up so now we'll have to pull this back down okay so we got this down here we're gonna cut this off Tighten it up. And, um, clean up all of this, and we're done. And so what I did was I just, I had the halyard up here. So I just used the halyard to tie this thing up because I didn't want to have to go get a whole new line um, during the, the crossing after this happened. But uh, yeah, you make do with what you got at the time just to make sure that everything is fairly safe. And well, that my friends is the fix and it's all done. Look how beautiful. We finally can see the Gibraltar rock. The other days it was way too gloomy. And a Mel 54, a Mel 50, there's a Super Marmu, and there's a Super Marmu, and then us, Super Marmu 2000. Both houses. I believe Ken said they are rented as a hotels, like a hotel room. It's very cute. They all have outboards, but I don't think they are moving. How cute is that? Day trip. Welcome to Gibraltar! Woohoo! 
That was easy. That was very easy to get through. I'm calling anybody with that phone. During your top of the rock visit, you will encounter the famous Barbary mechanics. These are wild, free roaming, tailless monkeys. They have sharp teeth and will bite if you do. There's a marina right over there. <laughs> so just a few days ago we sailed up through this area over here and then we sailed all the way through here and we ended up at our marina which is right over there oh now monkey's posing right next to the flag Are you missing Aquarius? No, I think I could see it. I can actually make it out. Uh. You want to climb the stairs? Holy oh. guacamole! Buddy, you want to come in? Coming in? <laughs> so cute! I don't know where all these tunnels go to. See if I can find it. You will. Bye. So the cable car is right over there, and we have to walk about 15 minutes to go see St. Michael's Cave. The caves were pretty cool, especially with a music and laser show going on. But we are off to explore further. Michael's Cave and the Mediterranean steps to O'Hara's Battery. Spyglass, we're gonna have to look that up. That's probably some type of MI5 network or MI6.
around. That must have been their spare gun. I'm gonna think I'm gonna sit here for a couple minutes and rest. So now I want to talk about our sponsor for this video, and that's The Rock. You may think you need insurance, and you do. And uh, The Rock is your insurance. So for those of you who don't have much in your life, you may be able to insure yourself with, with one of these. You just keep this with you wherever you go, and uh, you're basically insured. It doesn't look like they are very scared of the heights. Because they know they can grab on We are done with the rock, although one hitchhiker wanted to go with us. There goes the rock at Gibraltar. Anyways, we are still ready to explore a little bit more of the city, mainly the marina. And then we heard there is a beautiful park in there. So this is Queensway Quay Marina. It looks very private and very fancy. I think I see a mill. No way. American. It's a Super Maramu 2000, just like ours. It was a beautiful park, but we had a long day and we are tired. So we still get to appreciate those beautiful boat houses now in the night time. Next day we have another chore to do. It's on a controversial side though. So we've been told by many, many sailors, do get the firecrackers just in case orcas do come over you know we're not trying to hurt them but we don't want to end up sinking like other boats and we still want to finish our circumnavigation 80 euro 80 euro wow expensive so they want to see our papers <laughs> so here we come <laughs> so here we are all right. <laughs> we got checked out. We're all checked out now, and uh, we've been checked out thoroughly. Next on Sailing Aquarius. So those are the orca pingers. Yeah, these are whale pingers. We are in Morocco. If you like this video, give us a like, down below and click here to subscribe that really helps us and if you want to watch more of us click one of those they said they came from Spanish. Oh. Yeah.